Hi guys, I'm Naka Daptun, and welcome to my reaction for Free Tale episode 325. So, the stuff between Zeref and Mavis kinda concluded. Uh, Zeref is defeated, uh, both Zeref and Mavis helped Makarov. They kinda, I mean, he was supposedly dead, but kinda turned into stone. So they, like, um, brought him back. That was kinda sweet, actually. <laughs> But it looked like everything is happy and, you know, we've done what we've done, the villains are defeated. But then Natsu disappeared. So, like, what happened? Lucy, like, wasn't able to rewrite the book or what's, what is happening? And also, Akinologia is back. I assume because of that weird crackle in the sky. Well, uh, I mean, we still have a few episodes left, so something is definitely going to happen. Yeah, and I guess I'm just going to start it right now, because I'm really, really intrigued. It was a very sad episode, the previous one. Yeah, he d disappeared. Yeah, Lucy must feel so bad. I don't know what is happening. What is going on? Okay, I'm going to skip the opening. But I would definitely watch this opening before the last episode, because last episode, I think, has its own opening. Ah, oh, this song is so nice. Yeah. It's not the end, guys. It's definitely not the end. Yeah, a tiny little crack in the sky. People, Wendy, maybe a little louder. Girl, be a little louder. Yeah, and they all were. Well, it was sad that they sacrificed themselves, but I guess we got rid of a freaking Ecologia, which they did not. Who else it could be? I really want to see what is happening. <laughs> this kind of reminds me of freaking Hollows. How they always go through the gates in the sky too. <laughs> creepy, it's really creepy. Oh god, I can't wait for Bleach! <laughs> can't wait for it. Oh damn, he really... <laughs> He just busted through. That is a little scary, and I assume he is very pissed. Like, super pissed. Probably that what they were trying to do with him. Wor World destruction, you say? That sounds bad and spoilery. He's laughing. And that doesn't sound like fun laugh. That's a laugh of maniac. <laughs> yeah, we are in a big trouble. Okay. What is actually happening? Maybe you can explain. not what we wanted to hear, I guess. He big. Big and dangerous. No, it does not, sir. I'm sorry. I was kind of thinking that, I mean, his magic, he, he can keep 
he eats it, and if the rift has magic in it, um, you gonna. I I guess they thought there is so much magic that he would not be able to eat it. Uh, oh. I don't think these people can do much <laughs> for people. Well, uh, Akalogia is doing overdoing a little of this shite. Yeah, I was kind of thinking that could happen. But I guess they were thinking like it's too much of it, so he would not be able to do it. But seems like he did, ate it. Oh, he's destroying a, a lot of other shite also. So people run, I guess. Damn. Well, didn't we have the destruction a few times already? Maybe we should like stop with that? Maybe a little? Uh, people must be so tired of this shit. Damn, that's truly really some kind of distraction. Oh wow, that looks... That looks creepy. No, it's not. No, 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 we, we are not going... Thank you. We're not gonna let that happen. Thank you. Damn, the sky looks so creepy. Hey, Liz, the beams are just falling down from the sky. And they are powerful. Yeah, um, this is not a good thing time to be here kind of absolutely kind of i guess ouch it must hurt water like is cool but when you fall into it from such a high place it must hurt oh yeah he said something about trying to kill all those Dragon Slayers, eh? So she's a target. Maybe run away? I don't know, girl. Can you not do anything? I don't know, some weird shite. <laughs> Shut it! What he just did? That doesn't... I'm, I'm, I'm gonna erase them, I guess, theoretically. But they're still alive because he said like, yeah, I'm just going to shove them somewhere else. They are not going to be bothering me, I guess. Because I guess he's very well aware that because they're dragon slayers, they can slay him. And if there would be more of them, higher the chance. I guess that's actually kind of clever. God damn that the rift freaking upgraded him. <laughs> no. Oh, he's doing this to all of them? Oh. That's interesting magic. I only thought he's doing it to... Wendy only, but he's, yeah, pulling others too. So maybe Natsu got pulled too? Yeah. Oh, that sucks. I don't think you can do much about it. They're like, what the fuck just happened? <laughs> what is going on? <laughs> Ah, uh, it's kind of difficult to explain.
Oh, these two. They might put it together. Guess what all of them have in common? Yeah, I mean... They are strong and now they are gone. Doesn't sound too good. So maybe Natsu was pulled too? I don't know. Oh, what the frick is this? Crystal shite. It looks cool. Mm, I, I, I like the design. I do really like the design. It's kind of cool. Very alien like. Oh. And he's there too. I guess this is a final boss stage? So he does not want to trap them there. He wants to personally eliminate them there and they cannot escape. So that's why? I guess? Ah, oh, the design is so cool. At least he has a nice personal taste of his... Uh specific battle chambers or i don't know how to call it i mean he said personal space time space whatever dimension yeah he's pretty kind of hard he's just a dig though mm, unfortunately oh he trapped all of them already man works fast Well, ouch! <laughs> it did not mention name all the others. Ouchie. That sounds very overpowered. But he's also flying here. In Trigon. Yeah, so he wants to just eliminate them here easily. Because outside they probably would have a chance to like escape or fight him together, but for what though? What do we want to do? Some kind of crazy magical whatever shite? He said that. <laughs> I don't know if you heard him though. Poor city, town. <laughs> they had enough! Oh? More crackling. Okay, yeah, I was kinda thinking it might be possible they are alive. If I can like, yeah, I got out, they probably would too, right? Yeah. I was thinking this could be a possibility. At least they're alive. I, I mean... They shoved Acnologia inside. Acnologia ate the magic in the rift, or it ate the rift. So its function kinda ceased. So like, of course they survived too, right? Well, another dimension... Reality, whatever. I did thought about it though. <laughs> oh, lost control. Body and spirit. So I guess he has more weaknesses? Yeah. Interesting. So oh, he's not... Okay. Of course. And? 
Oh, that's why he wants to use them. That's why there are sacrifices. He gonna when he ate a rift, his powers kinda goofed a little and yeah, he probably would not be able to continue like this. So he wants to stabilize that, okay. It looks very nice actually. I really like its design. Right? It wouldn't be like that bad to be there well, for a little while. Probably not last forever because is there something to eat or drink? Yeah. I mean, come on, guys, you're a dragon slayer, so you should be able to do something. Yeah, but there's a like, well, maybe we should still try to do something <laughs> by swimming. I like, what well, you want to just stay here? Come on. Oh, can you teleport us? You have a lot of things to do to get things right, you know? So teleport all of their asses where they belong, sir. You are going to do a lot of teleporting. This looks hurtful. I really love the freaking design of the place. It's so cool. That sucks a lot. Ah, that place. I'm a fan. Seriously. Would not mind a pocket dimension like that at my disposal. It would be cool to chill in there. He's okay, he's okay. Yeah, she just did not know. She thought he probably disappeared and died because Zoraf died and she wasn't able to do stuff with the book. <laughs> that must have felt so bad. She probably thought it's her fault that she like wasn't able to do it, she did something wrong, wasn't able to override it properly or something like that. Oh, hello, Gildards. You're still here. Okay. All of them are here. Ah, oh, look at the squads. Look at the squads. All the people we can uh, befriend it along the time, uh, along the journey. Oh, Makarov is alive too. He looks... He's seen better days, for sure. Oh, okay. Do you have some kind of plan? Ah. I love this freaking place. <laughs> it looks so cool. In the... Well, he's tough. Don't underestimate Natsu. Yeah, I'm kind of trapped right now. <laughs> Time rifting me. <laughs> yeah, wouldn't put it better. Are we sure? Are we sure when there are split... Maybe we should, we need to like defeat both? True. Aw, Charles must be so worried. <laughs> and Fry, she cannot survive without him. Flesh for him. <laughs> yeah. Flesh for him, spirit form. Oh my god. <laughs> Girl! Come on, don't be pessimistic. Yeah, you can just give up. It's so cool to see like all of these characters be together, right? We met them, we fought against them, <laughs> but like we befriended them and now they're willing to help us. 
one big family. Close family and distant family, but still family, if you know what I mean. Ooh, that hand. I, um, that kind of hurts to look at. <laughs> it must hurt. Does it hurt using a fire or... I don't know, it looks so bad. Oh. Okay. This looks cool. And the music is like, hell yeah. Something they are fighting for. Of course. Are they all going to fight him or like hell not to fight him? Proper dragon slaying? Yes! <laughs> I've been waiting for this moment! Freaking dragon slayers! Finally! All of them. Okay. A little moody there. Okay, sir, but like we have seven, seven dragon slayers, which are really cool, really strong. On top of all of that, we have Natsu, who is like super upgraded. Dragon Slayer, so like I, I feel they might do some shite. I feel like they might do if they are going to willingly work together as a team. They might do some shite. I believe. <laughs> okay, I'm going to skip the ending. Oh my! It's a nice ending. I really like it. There is nothing. Okay. Okay. <laughs> oh, the ending got me so hyped. <laughs> I've been waiting for that for such a long time. Right? Oh, I've been li I've been waiting for it for such a long time. For like all these dragon slayers coming together and fight the final boss, dragon. <sighs> I'm so excited. <laughs> I mean, like, we saw some fighting Echolodia, right, but, or, like, fighting even some dragons before, but it was never like this. So, this is pretty hype moment. But, uh, Echolodia escaped that plan, which, yeah, I mean, they, they said she did not thought of it, but I'm like, that's a possibility still, and it did happen. He ate the rift. No, I mean, he can eat magic, whatever shot. It was probably based of magic made, whatever, full of magic. So he ate it, got power up. But like, kind of, now he is split in two. So he needs these dragon slayers to kind of be able to take control of his powers again. Maybe to become one. Right? That... that. I don't know, that's kind of weird, like, yeah, I'm still one person, but, like, there is my, uh, dragon form just flying around, and my consciousness is, like, here, my spirit, that, that, mm, that, that's a little weird, I would understand, like, working like this is probably troublesome, and maybe a little annoying, and, like, what if just one dies, would other part of him dies, I mean, they are still one thing, would it work? Do we need to kill both? Spirit and body? Or like... I don't know how this magic works. <laughs> this weird phenomenon. Right? But it would be definitely better to just get rid of them. For sure. So now they are going to fight him. And I'm very excited. Like I've said. Super extremely excited and i really love the place it is happening in it's such a cool design i love it so much 
oh my god, give me more of it. <laughs> it's such a cool place, right? It's just, it looks like a place you would love to chill in, right? Yeah. And of course, I love Acnologia, his design too, so... Yeah, I appreciate the design choices of this final boss battle. Wow. So I'm going to give this episode 7.5 out of a 10. And I'm really, really looking forward to the next one. <laughs> I'm just... I can't wait. I can't wait. We haven't seen all the Dragon Slayers working together for... I mean, have they ever worked together as much as this? Probably not. But like, there weren't some together. We haven't seen them for such a long time, right? Oh my god, I'm so happy. I'm so goddamn happy. This is what I've been waiting for. <laughs> oh. oh boy, well. But meanwhile, they're fighting the spirit part of Acnologia. Uh, the body is just flying around, destroying the shit. So I wonder what the others will think of. Like, they, they might be able to destroy the body, too. Then it would suck for Acnologia if they would not be able to defeat him because his spirit would still exist, but not a body. Where to go? I mean, given his strong magic abilities, he might be able to create some? But might not? That would kind of suck, not gonna lie. <laughs> we'll see, we'll see where this will be going. But yeah, I uh, need uh, the people who definitely need to do something about Akinologia's body flying around and destroying shit. Because, like I said, the, the town had enough <laughs> of destructions in like such a short amount of time, I would say. Even though they're kind of used to it because they uh, they have fairy tale guilt there so they're probably quite used to it but like it's been a lot of big distractions not gonna lie so um, you would eventually kind of get tired like please please i'm repairing my house for like 50 times already can we like stop can we not <laughs> please yeah for makarov he's been pouring money into all of this probably because every time they destroy something he needs to pay for that <laughs> Oh, yeah. <laughs> the worries. I am understandable. So, I'm pretty excited. And I guess that's all. Goodbye and see you next time.